Well, new tonight, we are hearing from one of the many victims in a disturbing peeping Tom case at a Norfolk gym. Yeah, according to court documents, 40 year old James Eddy III admitted to filming up to 20 women as they tanned at Planet Fitness. Attorney New Sides Liz Kilmer joins us from the newsroom with the latest on this story. Liz? Well, Tom and Nita, court documents say that Eddie, already a sex offender, filmed the victims from the ceiling above the bed. Some may not even know they were victimized, but the woman who we talked to says she'd realized what was happening. Now, meantime, she's trying to cope dealing with this and her husband's deployment at the same time, sharing her story now in hopes of helping other women. I entered the room and had heard some scufflings. Melanie Sampson didn't think much of it as she stepped into a tanning bed at the Planet Fitness on East Little Creek Road. But when she got out... At the time that I looked up is when I saw the finger through the ceiling tile. According to court documents, she's not the only one. Police charged James Eddy, already a registered sex offender, after he reportedly admitted to filming women at the gym from December to January. But it's taken an effect on me that just violated. Eddie's confession reportedly came during a lie detector test required as a condition of his supervised release after he served time for having child porn. That investigation launched in 2010 after he reportedly filmed a woman in a Chesapeake tanning salon. I don't know what possesses somebody to do that, but... I just want more women to be aware. Now knowing who the suspect is, Samson says she remembers him being there. After the incident, he came out of a nearby booth, she says, and tried to comfort her. He came up to me while I was sitting waiting for Norfolk PD to ask me if I needed anything, and he put his hand on my shoulder, and he asked me if I was okay. Ten on your side went to the suspect's home, less than a mile away from the gym. No one answered the door. A spokesperson for the company sent us a statement reading in part, quote, we take these matters very seriously. We quickly and fully cooperated with police in this matter. Samson says she doesn't blame the gym. She won't tan there again, but will still work out. But I didn't want him to change my life so much that I take away something that I enjoyed. And according to the documents, Eddie claimed he deleted the videos without uploading or transferring them. We're working to learn if investigators obtained any footage, if there's a way for other customers to find out if they were victims. As we learn more, we'll let you know. And of course, you can head to wavy.com for more details. Tom, back to you. 